Well, I sold my properties, my cars, and I sold. Actually, the 2021, I moved in. I was supposed to start a business. I was supposed to start off with a business. Yeah. Like my new year, like I want to do a side also. I couldn't. Yeah, because you were, you were yes. ill. I had to sell the property I was meant to start the business with. Right. Even with the capital, everything all gone. So. <sighs> and I've not been working. So it's really been tough. Yeah. Like, tough, tough. I was, yeah. I was naked the whole time. I was, I even wanted him, I, want, I wanted help. Because, you know, what happened was I, there's um, um, a fluid Mm. In mind, you know, so this is what this thing does. Mm. This disease, 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 disease. Mm -hmm. So it's um, kind of pull a lot of fluid in your lungs towards the heart. So that was the reason. Eventually, they knew what was happening. So that was the reason I couldn't breathe, and yeah. they had to be operated upon and yeah. to evacuate the, the, the fluid. Liquids. And yeah. yeah, so then I've been placed on medication and. I'm still running tests to see if it doesn't come back. And yeah. so I've been going in and out of the hospital. For a year? Yeah. When I was just diagnosed, I couldn't stand the pain. Right. Like, I cried like a baby. Like, I'll be crying. Even though I've been giving the dosage, yeah. I still, like, it was really, really bad. All my joints, my ball joints, everywhere. But, you know, with the medication I've been taking, so I feel less of pain. Except I'm having like a flare, like my um, inflammation information is really high. Mm -hmm. Then I'll know that um, I'm in for it again, so I have to go and see my doctor. So you're constantly dealing with with the pain. Yes, I got a place that I'll be laid in after I'm gone. Wow. So I thought yes. So wow. because I thought. Yeah. And at the time, that was at the time I was on oxygen because the breath keeps going down. Yeah. And I can see the expression on the doctor's Those faces. faces. Ah. <laughs> One doctor even told me, well, after the test, everything came out. It was like, if you, if, you, if you make sure you're with your loved ones and everything, at least you still have up to like five years. Wow. What do you think? That was me? when I said, I can't wait till then. I want to go now. But there's yeah. God on the throne. God had a different plan. Yes. God has a different plan. Yeah, he has. Here we are, still breathing. Here we are. But a million two hundred. Oh my goodness. Yes. So it might. It, it depends on the kind of body, your kind of body. So yeah. it might not work. So you're gonna so, spend that one point something. Yeah, it was anymore. not working. I was in pains. I was crying. I was the whole time. So at some point, I said, I don't even need the medication. Let me just wait for death to come. If that's what is going to kill me. But when I saw my daughter, mm. because initially they didn't want her to see me. Mm. So at some point that I was feeling like I couldn't breathe properly. So I said, let her come and see me in this position. Yeah. Let her come and see me. I need, her, I need to see, even if I'm going to die, I need to see it's my daughter. daughter. So I think one of the doctors, one of these doctors eventually came and he was able to actually tell me the kind of test I will run. And that test, they don't even do it here. So you have to, I think it was done at um, South Africa. But yes. they couldn't do it in Nigeria. I don't know what, I don't know if it's the machine they don't have. I don't know what the problem was. It was because we had to wait for like about two weeks or thereabouts for the results before the, yeah, for the results to come back. So eventually when, I knew something was wrong because yes. um, I had like up to like, 11 to between 11 and 15 doctors when they wanted to tell me what the problem was i just I, you know I, I i even thought it was something worse than what it was you know because you know i'm an actor so i could actually tell when the reactions on the doctor's faces so eventually um they were asking a question like do i still have do you, do i still want to have more babies hmm. like hmm. how many kids do i have and I'm sorry, 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 so, I'm sorry about that, yeah. so they'll ask me if I want to have more baby, I'm like yes I do, so I was told that is kind of 
there's a risk if I want to do that because what they're about to tell me, I will need to stay away from a lot of things. The, my life has changed forever. Thank you for joining our YouTube channel. I know, I hope um, you loved that video and you connected with it. Don't forget, please subscribe, please like, please share with your friends and family. Please comment. We love to see your comments and to see the full versions. Join our community right now or past episodes on watch.withtoday.com. Let's be human together.